Legend has it that on the start of the Chinese New Year, beginning on January 25th to February 8th, a monster by the name of Nian comes out and brings about danger to anyone outside. One night, a beggar wandered into a town where every house was boarded up. He walked to an elderly lady's house who let him in if he made the monster go away. This started the tradition of the Chinese New Year where people will decorate their houses in red paper, lanterns with fire, and a fireworks display. Missouri Western, along with several Chinese students, gathered in Blum and celebrated this event. This is the biggest holiday in China, and exchange Chinese instructor Fei-An Zhao says it's important for students to learn about this Chinese event. Okay, so uh, for this spring festival, it is the most important uh, festival in China. And I think uh, during this event, uh, all the students can come here to know more about the Chinese culture, like uh, why we celebrate the Chinese New Year and uh, how we celebrate it. Um, that's a very good way to learn some Chinese culture, I think. Students learned about the legend about how the New Year traditions began. They made their own red paper cuttings, played games where they could win prizes from China, and they even ate traditional foods from the New Year celebration. Student Elise Randleman participated in the games and said she thought she should get out of her bubble and learn about other cultures. I think it was pretty important just to know like background of the country and like their holidays and just to experience that. Just to know a little bit more about the world. Just like to be more open to the world because we're just so stuck in this far of lives that maybe just going out and do going to this event just to see more and to know more and just to just have a good time too. <laughs> 2020 marks the year of the rat and brings about new beginnings. The Global Center hosts events like this throughout the year. You can look out for them and learn about other cultures. Reporting for Griffin Media, this is Jessica Stallard.